All right, I was on my way to the beach and my tire started coming apart actually, right there. I heard it flapping on this thing. And this was yesterday and there was still air in it and I got it home. I was able to get it home. And right now when I went to go, I'm gonna go change it right now. The air was gone, so <laughs> I had to drive it up my driveway there with no air. Anyways, let's uh, take it off and maybe we can go to the beach today. I don't know. We're also out of gas. No money. So, see how that works out. Seems, seems like stuff always works out for me. Let's see if it does this time. All right. We actually made it down here with our tire problem and everything. Here's my first signal. It's an eight. Let's see what it is. There's a lot of trash down here though, so that's what I'm expecting. And like I said, a lot of trash. That's what it is, just trash. We got Alex today. I don't know why. Oh yeah, he helped pay for gas. That's how we made it down here. <laughs> Watch, I'll start detecting tort right towards him. Oh, he's, he went away. I'll go around him. You yell that, Alex? <laughs> Why do you get so offended? What? You get so offended by him. You just got wet. Are you happy? Are you, you just got wet now. I know. Why are you following me? I'm not following you. You're following me. <laughs> what? You're following me. Uh. Let me see, was that a signal? Doing Robert, stop! I think there's something there. Alright, no more playing around. We got a signal. Not a very good one though. And it's in the water. So let's see if we can do anything with it. Go deep. Ugh. All right, we should have it in the scoop. Uh, 
Oh, we don't. If we do, it's just iron. Alex is going to my spot now. Oh no, got covered up. So we're digging deep, deep in that hole. Deeper. I want this target. It's the only target on the beach. Now we should have it. Tone. Uh, it's trash. No, this is what you find when you see these guys digging with their tractors all around. Because I think they put it through a machine and the cans get shredded up like that. So, all right, back to it. So, the beach is really strange right now. It's like they scraped all the soft sand off and they put it up there along the shoreline for some reason. So it's down to the hard pack. That's why I decided to come up here. Now Alex followed me. <laughs> can you believe it? I guess I need to be paid back. Huh. Nothing on that one. So if you find anything in this part, it could be something good, like heavy, that really dug in to the hard pack. Uh. Oops. Yeah, there's just a little piece of green foil. Let's keep going. So I think we're, I'm gonna move beaches. This beach has not got anything on it. Yeah. See nothing. Actually, I'm leaving and I'm not telling Alex. <laughs> That's nothing. It sucks when I know, I know there's nothing, it's not worth digging. You think, oh, maybe it could be something, but no, you know it's not. So you don't dig it. A ring just makes a good solid sound. Coins make pretty solid sounds all the time, but not all the time. Same with a ring. But you know. So they did some kind of scraping on this beach. I know that. Uh, let's just go do the fire pits until Alex figures it out. All right, we're still moving to another beach, but I got a signal that might be something. It's giving us that quarter sound. I actually think I see something. Copper. Yeah, it's a lid. One of those little, uh, 
shots. I don't know what you call them. Those little bottles you get on airplanes or you used to get on airplanes. <laughs> Here's what an 18 sounds like. <laughs> One of these piece of aluminum. Anyway, so I'm almost back to the car and Alex finally caught on. So let's see if we can see him. Oh yeah, there he is. He's coming. Look at this rock I found. You can see quartz in there. There's black and then there's sparkles everywhere. Rocking. We're at a different beach now, and uh, there's nothing on this beach either. So, the water is chocolate. Looks like chocolate milk. Pretty cool looking. I got green in there. Uh, yeah. Where'd you find that? Right there. Put it in the trunk. I'm taking that. <laughs> I'm gonna cut the thing open. Anyways, that was just that was so, in there. somebody probably collected that and threw it there. Uh, we're on to beach number three. Uh, we didn't find nothing at this beach either, right, Alex? Yeah, nothing. Just a bunch you, of balls. You, you want people to watch my video? Just a bunch of balls. Um, everyone, um, Robert's. Robert has cancer, so everyone, everyone, just stop. Go to my channel. It's, he's gonna, he's gonna quit the way soon. Just, just, just messing with you guys. Go to his channel. Subscribe. <laughs> he doesn't have cancer. <laughs> and don't watch Alex's. What channel. do you mean? You little so Alex broke the rock open. Look, it's got blue in it almost. That's really cool. I might uh Please. polish that up. Put it on a polisher. That's perfectly. That's a perfect cut. Look at that. I don't know about perfect cut. But it, 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 look at that, is that gold? Oh wow. Either gold or mica. Look, look, put pinpointer on it. My pinpointer's not that strong. Yours is better. Oh, we should have detected the rock. Swiped our detector over it. Put it on gold mode? Yeah, put it on gold mode, put it over the rock. <laughs> Dude, that might be gold. He's dreaming. Well, thought we had a suitcase full of money, but it's not. Oh well, I didn't want to show it on camera because uh, if it was, you guys would never know. <laughs> you see, all of a sudden, Robert has money. <laughs> There's nothing down here. I left that hammer on the ground. I left that hammer on the ground by your car. No, I put it away. It's one of my favorite shells. Oh, there's still a clam in there. It's all purple. Somebody just crushed it. Anyways, there's nothing down here. Uh, should probably move to the next beach. Did I speak too soon? Let's see. Hopefully I spoke too soon. <laughs> Pretty clean sound to 17. Where is it? Oh, it is a penny. Zinc penny, probably. Yep. That's a good sign. Actually, a coin. Keep going. Alright, I got another sound. 
16, 17. Hopefully it's not the same thing, but it sounds like it is. Either missing it or it is deep. All right, we got it. Uh, probably deep because it's a big piece of aluminum. I think they brought sand in over here too. Anyway, let's keep going. Alex found a bag that's all tied up. He's opening it up right now. It's probably somebody's sleeping bag. Purposely? Maybe there's a dead body in there. Imagine. It smell like a dead body. It smell that bad. Yeah, it's filled with sand. You never know, it's perfectly tied up. So we might have been hiding something, you never know. It's in the box. Could be full of poop. <laughs> think too much. This is too, way too much work. Remember that, remember that one? I got that tied. Whoa, look at all that. That's <laughs> sand. Wait, I, it, was, it was tied up. So I don't know why it would be sand if it was all tied up. It was a trick, and you fell for it. I was wondering what happened to you. Where was it? It was over there on the rocks. Uh, well, I hit something. It beeped? It beeped. Maybe there's a penny in there. A penny for all this. It was tied up pur purposely, so I was thinking it'd be something. <laughs> hey, maybe I'm wrong. I found a signal. Pretty solid 13. So it could be a nickel. Let's see what it is. I'm not counting on it. But so far today, we've only found a penny. See something shiny. Uh, piece of aluminum. Half a beaver tail. Anyway, back to it. Was there anything in that bag? No, nothing. <laughs> a tied up blanket? Well, we didn't find anything down there, but it sure was beautiful. <laughs> a beautiful day. It's uh, been raining for two days, and so we hit three beaches. I don't know if we're going to hit another one or what we're going to do next. Just left Alex down there. I hope he comes soon. Hope he realizes I left him. He has, I don't see him following me though. Anyways, walking in the middle of the street. Remodeling their whole home, it looks like. <laughs> that thing all gutted out. I'll either do a wrap up or whatever next. I don't know. Maybe another beach. We'll see. All right, we made it home, <laughs> and it is wrap up time. Uh, I found a bunch of balls for my dog, so whipped it up. Here we go. You guys get to see exactly what I found. What should I say? What I didn't find. 
Got one penny, one rock, some trash, a little piece of trash. And that's it. That's all trash. There's rock. Nothing special, just a stupid rock. Put it with the rest of the rocks. And we got our penny. At least I think it's a copper penny. It's, it's wore down to where you can't spend it, but it won't go in one of those machines. So, yeah, got some copper. Uh, I shouldn't even be posting this video, but well, here, you, here it is. You guys see it. If you guys are watching me right now, you saw the video. That means I posted it. Um,. Yeah, I just, I don't know, I just can't believe we made it. I was just talking about my tire being trashed. I mean, I almost, I was on my way to the beach when that happened. I almost, I could have died. Uh, started making that noise, floppy noise on your wheel well. And I knew right away, my tire shredded. Because it, it was wobbling, I could tell. And then I just got off and just drove on the side streets home. And I made it. And then the next morning it was flat and we changed it this morning so uh, back down to the beach with Alex and he helped pay for gas so we got another video at least uh, sometime right now just getting to the beach ends up being the adventure <laughs> uh, all the drama I have to go through just to get there if I just lived down there, it would be life would be so much easier. I could check I could check more beaches, and we'd probably find a lot more stuff. I would know exactly where to go. But I live in good a ways away from the beach, so that ain't happening. Um, well, I hope you guys like this video. Um, there's no update on the t rock tumbling. Got these same old ones from our first tumble. I really like these though. I just went to a rock store. I was looking at some of their rocks and I like mine better. They have little rocks that are perfectly tumbled and mine are better, I think. <laughs> They had every kind, like they had, they had them separated, like in bins. I don't like that side of this one, but this is my first tumble. These are my first, so. And I'm just learning all this tumbling stuff, and it takes months and months because just to do one batch took the, at least a month, maybe longer. And the next batch is taking a month and then the, the next one took longer and then yeah this just goes but we're, we'll get it down and we'll probably end up what i think's going to happen is it to get the rocks the best we're just going to have to do them longer for the first stage wear them down to where we like them at least rocks that i collect myself if i order some online yeah it'd probably be easy to get some really nice rocks first try you know anyways i'll see you guys in the next one the rain's over again so i can uncover everything this is covered my black sand's covered all these rocks are covered uh because if, if it doesn't strain out like see how i have this in a strainer i don't like to leave them in the rain because then you got a standing water that that one drains out uh, and you don't want your rocks sitting in standing water, then they become dirty. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one.